good about about uh, first time out this year? Yes, yes. This is my first long course meet uh, and first race since Dubai. So you definitely have to dust off the racing cobwebs a bit. And uh, since I'm swimming 100 back and 100 freestyle this summer at World Championships, I've been really working on those two strokes. So um, I'm really happy with that butterfly. Uh, that's a very, very good time for me. Um, and I just watched the video, and it looks a lot better than it feels. <laughs> feels terrible. But uh, 58 I'm very happy with that. What was, what was your goal heading into this meet? I mean, you're obviously training through it, but... And then yeah. Um, just to get a sense of where I am in the season, uh, a lot of times when you're a postgraduate summer, uh, you don't have those races every weekend like you would in college. Uh, and like, for me, that keeps me focused uh, in my training and just to know where I'm going, and, and it's a good evaluation tool for me. Um, from that, from there on, it's just it's just good to get up and race three days in a row and to watch each race and see where I could improve for the meets. In the future. Yeah, you took 18 months off, you know, after um, after Beijing, and do, do you think that that has given you, I mean, obviously you're a diverse person, you have a lot of other interests and stuff, but what did they, did, did you feel like, did you never left, did it give you... It was, it was interesting because I was gone for a year and a half, and then my first meet back, it felt like just getting back on, on the bike again, you know, like it felt like I wasn't gone very long. Um, I know so many people here on deck, and you see so many friends and people you've been on teams with for 10 years or so, um, and not everyone can take a break, but me, I, I needed it. Like I mentally just needed to step away for a little bit, uh, not because I was burnt out or anything like that, I just... At you know 26, 27, 28, I just wanted to know what my life would be like without swimming because I I really don't know what it would be like. So I enjoyed my time away. Um, it kind of rejuvenated me, and now like I, I feel like I'm in really good shape going into the next year and a half. You feel like you've got a new perspective on on this whole thing now that you had been away? Um, yes and no. I, I think I, I gained some perspective being that. I'm happy with my career so far, and no matter what happens, I will be happy with my career, so everything else is just kind of, like, it's cliche, but it's icing on the cake, it really is. Um, so, in that sense, I got some perspective, and um, it's, it's just good to be back racing. It, it's nice to focus on lesser events, uh, and not, not worry, I don't think I'm going to do six events again, because that was, that was hard, and it, it's hard to train and prepare for that type of thing. So it's nice to focus on a couple events and, you know, feel like I can still improve. Dana was mentioning how much um, you help her, you know, in training and stuff. How, how does she help you? Um, you know, it's just good to have someone who also has a lot of pressure on them and who goes to these meets and, and uh, you know, swims. Train differently, but... Yeah, we, yeah, we train differently, but uh, it's just nice to have someone who is also on you know, the summer teams, and so uh, you have that focus. Mm -hmm.